there on YouTube. Ain't your boy Trail checking in with another video. I know it's been a minute. I know it's been a minute. Uh, I just long story. We ain't going go into all that today on this video. We gonna make that a vlog video. Uh, we gonna make that a vlog video. That's what we gonna do. But we gonna talk about this pickup. I did pick it up on release day. I got waitlisted, so I didn't really know if I got it on Friday. I didn't know I got it Friday. But then when I got waitlisted, I was like, oh, I ain't probably going to get it. And I'm getting it, going to pick it up. Needless to say, after that, I ended up shooting a video and didn't post it. Uh, holiday weekend, I ended up just having fun. So after that, days went by. And now I'm posting it. But I also was supposed to. I, was, I wasn't going to do just a basic review on the shoe. I was actually going to show the shoe with some of the pieces that I picked up from Shein on the latest haul that I got. But I'm just going to slice it and dice it and make it two separate videos. Do the review on the shoe and then show you the pieces that I got from Shein, which will be in the next video. So this video is coming up on a Wednesday night, which will probably be like a Thursday, Wednesday, Wednesday night, Thursday video, morning video. Then I'm going to shoot another one for Thursday night, which will be a Thursday night, Friday morning video. And then I'll do Saturday video because uh, I still got to do smuggler corner videos. I just been slacking and I need to get these numbers up. And a shout out to everybody that's been showing love on the channel. Shout out to the haters. I didn't even realize I had haters. How do, how do you get haters? I don't even... Listen, let's talk about since my channel isn't based on sneakers. My channel is a lifestyle channel. Uh, I had a guy get in one of the comments on one of the videos on the Shein video. He don't try to tell me what size shirt I wear. He got mad with me because I'm telling him what size shirt I wear. Well, there's no way you wear that size. And I'm like, dude, like, <laughs> internet is crazy. Sometimes I see why I didn't go crazy with my last YouTube channel. And this one, I don't take it as, as serious because people get on the internet and they just talk just to hear they... They just talk just to hear they self, man. And I ain't got time for it, man. But let's let's get into this shoe, man. Um, you seen the box, so you know what it is. Air Jordan 1 Retro High OG Black Metallic Gold Palomino. Am I saying that right? Palomino? 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 Let's, uh, let's get into it. <sighs> I don't even know if these came with extra laces. They get this shoe from Foot Locker. So I don't even know if these came with extra laces or not. If they did, somebody stole mine, which wouldn't be the first time my laces have gotten stolen out of shoes. I don't know what the deal with that is. I'd rather them start tying them in the shoe like they used to do. Then that way, can't nobody just steal them. They got to unlace the shoe to steal them. Boom. The Air Jordan 1 High OG Palomino. Now, let's... Let's get a good look at these things, man. Let's let's set that there. Let's get a good look at them. But I really haven't looked at them. I've really just been like, eh. This is crazy. These is crazy. Now, in my opinion, these, let's give you that other side. These look better than the Travis Scott's. They look better than the uh, mochas. Like, in my opinion, and you might say, well, uh, you're only saying it because you ain't got them. Been there, done that. Both of them. Multiple times. And I would rather the low, that low, like mocha, Travis Scott, over the highs. That's just my opinion. And I actually want that shoe, too. That, high, that low mocha one, that's crazy. I want it. That's like one of my grills right now. I want that shoe. I like the colors on that low. But this is crazy with the black ah, and then the, the, the cream and the, the Palomino. Woo! Now, I've been hearing people talk about they don't like this. This is what they don't like. That, uh, that Nike sign, that gold. It, I don't know why. It ain't that big of a deal to me. It's just. Uh, it's just like you probably won't even see it. I mean, I don't know too many people that wear their tongue out like that, but these it's crazy. 
It's got the gold in the inside. Man, but these is crazy. Do they got that? Yeah, they got that smell. They got that smell. Woo! Woo! They got that smell. They smelling good. Now, this was a pickup. This was a nice pickup. Uh, it wasn't too hard to cop. I don't feel like it was. I, I actually know a couple stores that still got some here in Indy. So if you ain't got them, I mean, you probably call a couple stores. They sold out on sneakers, which we know. Um, what else happened to them? I think that's pretty much about it, man. I, oh, they did get, some of them did get released early on that, uh, well, they didn't get released early. They got stolen from that uh, Memphis truck. They got a Memphis train carrier that got hit, which that is a inside job. We all know about that. That's just how it goes. So I ain't really want to hold y'all too much longer with this. This is just my rendition of a review on this shoe. Pretty much same thing. Coco, we're gonna call this Coco Brown bottom, Coco, you know what I'm saying? The mocha color, whatever you want to call it. With the black. I love this color, man. This they call it Palomino, but I I don't feel like this. It looks more of a brown gray. Because it looks gray in certain lights, like a charcoal, not a charcoal gray, but like a, I don't even really know how to pronounce that. Like, I mean, not pronounce it, but to say the color that I really want to say, but it looks like a stone gray. That's what it looks like, like a stone gray from a distance. Up close it does, but when you, like on the camera, it's brown. You can, you can see it like that, that mocha cocoa color. With the cream midsole and everything. Uh, dope shoe. Must cop for the collection. Dope for the fall. Like I said, I got the try on haul. First try on haul of the fall season with some clothes for the big and tall fellas that follow me. Shout out to y'all, man, because y'all keeping me motivated to do what I'm doing because, hey, ain't nobody else doing it for us. There's a couple guys doing it, but yeah, it ain't doing it the way we really want them to do it. They doing a lot of other stuff with the stuff, and we like I don't I don't know too many guys that's really wearing tight clothes like that, and like they be they be putting that they put some stuff on, but they don't be putting it on like they they be tight and like ain't too many big and tall dudes wearing tight clothes like that. Not none that I know, so that's why I give my. My point of view on the big and tall, the way I do it, and you know what I'm saying, I get I get fresh when I want to. You know what I'm saying. If you've seen pictures on IG that I have posted and stuff that I have got down with, um, I'm gonna start doing more. Though. I'm gonna start shooting more pictures of myself just to show because I don't really think people really get what I be doing over here. I be I be doing what I be doing. I might start doing them get ready with me, but I don't really gonna wear. I don't gonna wear so. I really just be putting on clothes to go to the mailbox, which is crazy, or, yeah, to the mailbox, but I don't know, it's, it's fall time, fall time, you can put that shit on, and summertime, it's kind of like, summertime, I really, summertime, I really don't put nothing on, unless I'm going somewhere, but other than that, it's like, basketball shorts, kicks, fitted, tee, and, you know what I'm saying, if you know me, you know me, like, I love black tees, whether it's hot or not, like, black tees go with anything, White tees, you got to worry about too many stains. You go around kids, they touch you. You lean against a car, it's a stain. Or you might be eating something and you drop it and it's a stain. All that good stuff. So that's why I really don't like white tees like that no more. When I was younger, I did, but that's when they was 4 for 20. Tees ain't 4 for 20 no more. You used to get them for 4 for 20, 21, 19. But we're going to get up out of here with all that, man. This video is going too long. We're going to get back with y'all in the next video. Y'all be good. Y'all be great. And remember, rock what you want. It's the review on the Palomino Air Jordan 1, man.